first step in business card we need to set up the page and uh, we'll change the unit to inches and here give 3.5 and here give 2 and to artboard and now click on create now from the toolbar select this rectangular tool and here draw the rectangles over both the artboard and change the color now by using pen tool here draw the triangle and change the color so that we can easily identify and draw one more triangle from here and change the color for these two and now draw a rectangle here and bring those at the front and change the color similarly by using pen tool here also draw to triangle shape and now select this and reflect it so double click and choose vertical copy again reflect it by taking it here now reflect it again horizontal ok now draw a small rectangle at the bottom here now let's zoom in by pressing ctrl plus on your keyboard and now drag the shape to the other end up to here and uh, you can change the color select the shapes by pressing shift key do right click and send it to front now here draw a rectangle like this by using pen tool draw a straight line here select them and uh, by using shape builder tool change the color and make a shape now take them down and make duplicate by pressing alt key and make a duplicate ctrl d and repeat it let me drag the shape little bit now again select them by pressing alt key make duplicate by pressing ctrl d and make duplicates like this let's change the color of the pattern so i'm using some ready-made color here because i don't want to waste your time and mine too let me bring this one here so in this way change the color for all the patterns now delete those select it by pressing alt key make a duplicate Ctrl plus D and make one more duplicate like this. Select them and make it a group. Now here let's change the color. So on the side you can see the gradient color, the mixture of gradient color I am using here. now let's draw a rectangle here 
and let's bring our pattern over this new rectangle let's make it a duplicate and place it perfectly here now let's change the color to the white because uh, we're gonna use the clipping mask and now do right click and take it front and from here choose multiply and here you can reduce the opacity now let's lock it because it is disturbing us select this one and make duplicate change the color and bring the new pattern over it so here we'll make one more clipping mask place this one at the perfect position so that we can get a nice shape now select both by pressing shift key and do the clipping mask and bring it to front now select this one and choose multiply select this clipping mask and lock it because it is disturbing us and take this one front now let's unlock those things we have locked before and take this one in at the front and here also change the color change the color for this one too now drag it by pressing alt key and make duplicate and place it here and make one more duplicate copy paste in place now let's delete those we don't need those things anymore and now here we'll draw a shadow Similarly, draw a few more shadows And here also create some shadows like this. Now select all the shadows by pressing shift key and change the color. let's make duplicate of that copy paste in place and here also draw one shadow so here i am using some ready-made details you can create your own details and place it like this let me make it a little bit smaller now it looks perfect so this is what we have done so far hope you like this tutorial and if you are new to this channel you can support us by doing like share and subscribe thank you